Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's why this wood sucks. So, it chips off easy. This weighs nothing, by the way. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, a uh, shell. Too bad it's, uh, you know, this is the wood. It sucks. Might plug it. You can see it here and here. So that's what you get if you use cheap, cheap ass plywood. It might work uh, maybe over here, for instance, but so I have to fix that somehow. Uh, this line is here, so I know where to drill a hole for the cable. But uh, I'm pretty sure this wood is not actually gonna work. But I am gonna check if the driver fits in here. That's kind of important. So let me get one. As per usual, I forgot to uh, flip the image. So, if you have the driver, there's this connection here, and I made like a cutout over here. That's nice if you look at it like this, but this driver is going to be sitting like this, of course. So, yeah, I forgot to flip it over. But I can see if it fits if I put it in like, like so. Or, yeah. Cool. That fits quite nicely. Wow, wicked. So, uh, I'm gonna redo it. Hopefully, uh, those holes are not there uh, as well. And I'm uh, gonna flip the image first. But, uh, well, I'm glad to see that this very thin wall holds up. Well, almost everywhere hmm it's uh, unreadable but 15.5 grams <laughs> that's light didn't know it was that light oh, let's uh, throw it in the scrap okay so uh I flipped the image over and uh, I'll give it another go. I'll uh, roll the camera but speed it up as usual I guess. And this is where we start. Thank <laughs> you. 
Now here there's gonna sit a piece of wood on top of this that uh, is connected to the headband hopefully. But this works so I'm gonna make another one. Maybe two actually, I don't know. Just to have one spare. why it decides to go in constant or not constant velocity but exact stop. Might be Kanban uh, screwing me over there, I don't know. Does it look great? No, not, act not really. But the sandpaper could help. I got one. A little more sandpaper will be required. But I think you get the idea. Oh, a hole. I have to plug it. This material is of course not great for this. Good thing it is actually really light, but the bad quality and glue uh, gluing is uh, is not so much great. Well, that's one. That's nice. Aligning them uh, is much easier like this. Am I gonna change the whole code or am I gonna work like I do right now, probably? Yeah, <laughs> cool. They look a bit like the biodynamic... Uh, what is it? Well, let's do the next one. Same method uh, with the same fuck-ups.
Well, you got the idea. This is a bit random, but uh, I'm not sure how to do it otherwise. So, you know. Okay, so far so good. Uh, maybe I should make a hole for the cable as well. I'm not sure what I'm gonna use. I don't have actually good cable and I'm not gonna put connectors in there. I mean, it's not worth it. So I thought about maybe using... I got this flexible cable. It's rather thick. Hmm. Might have to take a look inside if I got some suitable cable and drill a hole for it. I had some cable uh, relief thingies, but they're for really tiny cables since uh, that's what the headphone uses, of course. Used before, of course. Uh, so, let's first see if I can fit it on the frame. So, we got the frame. Uh, I want to autofocus, please, maybe. So the frame it has these pegs that will uh, go in inside, hopefully, in these things. So this is going to be fiddly, especially in front of the camera. So something like this, and then hopefully I can stretch this far enough without breaking it. Yeah. A little rough. Hmm. Okay. Don't want to break anything. Ha. Kind of fit. If you do this a lot, you wear it out, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Isn't that funny? That's a weird headphone. And then this one comes over on here. Ain't that weird. Yeah, it actually uh, works quite nice. So the cups are uh, <laughs> way bigger than they were before, but I like in this direction. Hope it still works. If not, well, I'll try. I tried. So I have to look for some cabling, and I might be able to 
finish it, although not today because it's 8 o'clock already. You know how it goes if you will finish it, it's gonna be a bummer. I like this this fact that this is uh, like really aligns well. Just some glue and then you got a complete cup. I think it's really cool. I love having a CNC. Couldn't do without. So here's gonna be padding. A lot of it. And uh, yeah, we'll see. See you next time.